Alexa, turn it off. Maybe don't be late, don't be late. No. Hey, my nigga, mommy, lady, I go. Mommy, lady, I go. I go to bed. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Mr. Caramel, and I'm back again with another banger and today's video as you guys have seen from the title you guys are going to get lit with me and we're going to make some fried rice and chicken you know what i'm saying because you're supposed to be hungry off in here like i'd be confused for what to cook sometimes so hopefully this will give you guys a bit of advice for like what to make and how to like put your food together if you like more of these caramel cook episodes make sure you guys comment down below and i'll do so much more for you guys give me some foods that i can make you know what i'm saying but yeah i really hope you guys enjoy this video if you haven't already make sure you subscribe to my channel instead caramel rose 2k and if this is your first time seeing me hi i hope you stay show some love to my channel and make sure you like comment share and subscribe and let's get straight into the video <laughs> Shout out to my V over these tracks. Oh, y'all, the seasons I've got are all laid out here. Come on, come closer. So, we've got some salt. I've got some of this. It's a smoky barbecue marinade, so marinade seasoning. I've also got some aromat. This is like my go to every day. Do you know that go to? Got some mixed herbs. And we've got some chicken peri peri um chicken fry mix and we've also got some like we need it that's that's a key also have like frozen vegetables these are so much more easier and they last longer than fresh so like yeah this one is the mixed one with like vegetables in it with like everything you've got carrots everything's in this one it's my favorite one and i got this from new and then we've also got these mixed vegetable ones for the fried rice. So these are really good for me. Like, I usually like putting these ones because you can like, they last so much longer and it's already pre-cut. Like who has time to be chopping up? For today's chicken, I've got um, some British chicken breast fries. And this is from Asda. So I'm going to use these and season it, put them in the oven, jump in, get a bit. Mm. I think I'm going to start with my chicken first because I need to cook these. So let me go wash these and I'll be right back. Guys, my pet piece for chicken is taking off the flipping hairs. Like, I hate hairs, but like, if I see hair on my chicken, like, I'm gonna cry because like, I can't eat that. So I take my time to really, really get the hairs off because that's really important to me. Like, I just feel like, come on. But I'm just washing it and putting it into this. So guys, I have washed my chicken and here it looks so pretty. And um, so then now I'm basically gonna boil my chicken because I don't like putting it straight into the oven because then it won't cook properly. So what I'm gonna do is boil it and I'm gonna put some seasons inside of the, that. And I'm gonna chop up some onions, put in my chicken, you get that sauce, you know what I'm saying? Maybe don't be late, don't be late, My nigga, why me I go? Basically, steam it up with some onions. So it should, it should look like this. Stupid. I'm gonna put some vegetable oil into the pan. So I've got my onions going in a pot. I'm gonna go fry my vegetables. Scary. These oils, yeah. Guys, by the way, I've already made my rice separately, so um, if you guys are actually thinking about where my rice is at, <laughs> I've already made it. 
so I'm just like basically frying up my vegetables. Jay! Jay! Did you think I me too? I still think of you. Shout out to my guy JJ Flavors on Instagram. Make sure you guys follow his Instagram. He's a really, really good cook. So if you need some more advice on cooking, he just started his new page. So make sure you check him out. So I'm gonna add a bit of rice and then mix. You get the gist. Also gonna go in and add some of my chicken stock. When my chicken stock is so much better, I promise you. I just added, I actually added some soy sauce to it, just give it a bit of colour because it was kind of lacking a bit of colour. But um, the chicken stock really gave it a good flavour. Here is the food, the fried rice, it's so good. The chicken stock gave it like, a really nice flavour. Like, I really, really think you guys should use a chicken stock. And I'm just going to give it a taste. It tastes really, really good. I'm actually sorry for cutting my fried rice. The only thing I can say, I just wish my fried rice was more dry. I like a dry fried rice. So my chicken should be done. So we're going to take it out of the oven and check for that chicken. I can't eat chicken, but fried rice is chicken. Mm. Like, that's a whole meal. I'm a whole meal. Like, we go together. <laughs> Let me go, let me zoom in and show you guys properly. The nicest food looks. Mm. And then that's the chicken, it's really, really nice. So guys, I'm gonna end this video there. I really hope you guys enjoyed me cooking in my kitchen, making some fried rice and chicken. If you guys would like more episodes of Caravan Cooks, make sure you comment down below. Make sure you get on my socials and make sure you leave a like, comment, share and subscribe. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Bye.